Hey, what's up, people? So, doing another video. I know I haven't done one in a while. Um, here is the authentic iPod Shuffle. This is like, I think, a second generation or something like that. It is, um, I believe, two gigs in capacity. And it's got the off, on, and it's got uh, repeat or shuffle mode. Uh, the headphone jack right here, an indicator light. Um, she has five buttons right here, and that's pretty much it. But I'm going to be comparing it today to the fake iPod shuffle that came from China. Got this on eBay for about a buck, I think. I already took it out of the envelope, but it came wrapped up in this thing. So. Here's what it looks like. They sent me pink by accident. So it comes with this like foam thing right here. Here it is. So I'll just put that right there for now. Um, some earbuds. If you thought the Apple earbuds were cheap, then these are super cheap. You can kind of hear them rattling and stuff like that. Let's see. They do have the microphone on it as well. So that's kind of a plus. Let's see what that does. So, MP3 player. It's got a play, pause button, menu. Um, next track, previous track, volume. It's on while any button is pressed when hold is off. So I think it has a hold button on it. Press play pause for three seconds to toggle the hold on and off. That's pretty much it. I mean, alright, so here we go. It has got a... It's got a micro SD slot right here. A a mini USB or a micro USB connection right here. Uh, this is a screw. It's got the clip also. It's got the headphone port and an on off button. And it looks like it's got a blue light right there. So as far as the play pause it looks like while this is volume up right here this is volume up right here so it's kind of oriented this way so you got up volume up volume down next track previous track and this is up down next previous so um, it's got like a little slight wow kinda has like a bend to it I'm not sure if you can tell It's like concave right there a little bit, or maybe convex, depending on how you look at it. It's got a curve like that. Now it looks like it did not come with any charger, but that might be okay because I think I might have something to charge it with. I mean, it is his standard USB, so it should be easy enough to charge. Size-wise. The length of these things are the same, but you can tell that this is much fatter than the iPod. But the good thing about it is, is I mean, first of all, I, I think I got this for seriously like a dollar. Um, so really, I don't really care if it gets damaged or anything like that. Secondly, it takes a micro USB, so you're not going to connect this to iTunes. You're just going to load up your USB card. While this capacity is 2 gigs, this one is like, you know, however much your SD card holds. So that's pretty good. Um, for me, I'm going to use this like at the gym. You know, we have like the steam room and the sauna, so I'd rather take that in there rather than my um, genuine Apple iPod. So it's just kind of like a beat up little MP3 that I got, and hopefully it works. Um, buttons feel a little like harder to click. They're more funner to click on the fake one. Much more smooth and stuff on the 
Apple one. But they're just funner to press for some reason. So anyways, I ended up finding this card that you need. This is a Samsung H8 gig. And be careful with these cases when you open them, because these things always pop out. I mean, one just went under the couch, and I just gave up looking for it. But these cases suck. So micro SDHC. Do not know how to get this thing to focus. Anyway, so you just put that in here like this. and boom that is going to give you your capacity on here so now all of a sudden this is an 8 gig mp3 player while this ipod shuffle is just 2 gigs so this one you know you can beat it up throw it around you know take it into the hot rooms um, without worrying about it too much because the only thing that's really of value is this right here and this I got for two bucks anyway, so that was a good deal. Free shipping. Um, so yeah, there you go. That is that. And then to load this up, all you need to do is get the adapter for this and um, put that into your computer and load it up with music so you don't have to use iTunes either. Um, hopefully that was helpful. Here again is a little comparison this one's a little thicker a little thinner the Apple one's a little bit heavier I would say but they're actually really similar on the weight um, definitely better construction on the Apple one but you know this is nice to have because you don't have to worry about it too much alright take it easy